Hello and welcome to the roundup of this week's edition of the Engineering News and Mining Weekly magazine, published on Friday, 11 November 2022. In this week's cover article, Engineering News and Mining Weekly Senior Deputy Editor Skulk Berger writes that hydrogen is set to play a key role in the hard-to-abate transport sectors. Green hydrogen's value lies in decarbonizing difficult-to-abate sectors such as heavy vehicle mobility and industrial processes, with heavy vehicle transport seen as a lead market. The engineering news features focus on valves, where a specialist is awarded a testing and maintenance contract. Energy efficiency and management, where the city of Cape Town is on track to become an African energy diversification beacon. And bearings and bushes, where a bearings company successfully completes a company acquisition. The Mining Weekly features focus on health and safety, where a mining group aims to regain 2021 safety performance and oil and gas in Africa, where volatile prices present opportunities for exporters. This week's business leader is Bradley Rogers, CEO and MD of Jupiter Mines Limited. And as this week's cartoon shows, the scrapping of e-tolls became inevitable when there was massive civil disobedience. What is less inevitable is whether the Gauteng authorities will come up with an acceptable funding plan to maintain and expand the highway network. We hope you enjoy this week's edition of Crema Media's Engineering News and Mining Weekly. Be sure to subscribe to the magazine that offers you in-depth news about developments in the real economy by emailing subscriptions at engineeringnews.co.za. Happy reading and see you next time.